learn how to make this beautiful cross picture frame on Hey mom All right so I'm going to list all the supplies on the top of the video For this I used an 8x10 picture frame uh, I just got it from the dollar store and you see here I'm removing the paper and the, the glass from it you're not going to use that at all I decided to paint the frame a maize color I thought that would go well with the craft instead of the black that it came in and um, I also decided to paint the center cross that I'm going to use for this um, because I just love this color okay so we're gonna set that aside and give it a chance to dry and while that's drying we can work on the backing I had this material that I wanted to use and uh, all you have to do is um, make sure you have a slightly bigger size than the picture frame so this is about uh, maybe an extra inch so like about 9 by 11 piece that I'm cutting out here and then I used hot glue to just um, glue that to the back uh, you see I'm using uh, the hot glue on the back side of the frame uh, so that it wouldn't show on the front it didn't bleed through but I, I was just worried about that Okay, while I'm thinking about it, if you uh, like this video and, and you get any value from it, feel free to hit the like button and share the video. If you do decide to subscribe to Hey Ma, make sure you hit the bell icon so that you don't miss a single video. We're going to be trying to uh, upload a little bit more often and I'm going to try to get my mom back into it. She does crafts in the middle of the night and so they rarely get recorded. All right, so I, I glued the back on and I glued the, glued the um, corners down just so that it would be neat. And you see here, I'm fastening it back to the dried picture frame and using the little metal prongs to uh, make sure that's fastened. All right, so the burlap that I had in was this beautiful orange color. I picked this up, I think, from Walmart back in the fall. And I've been waiting to use it, so it's going to be used. All right, so I'm just cutting out the burlap a little bit larger than the picture frame, um, keeping in mind that you want to make sure there is a little bit of slack because we're going to tie the centers of the burlap together. So you want it to be a little bit loose. So I am using the string to tie it here, and you see how it is as tight as it can be. I wouldn't be able to tie it any tighter than this, so that's why you want to give it a little bit of leeway. It's okay because this is in the back. Now the top one, I did give myself a little bit more slack there. First I got to glue it down. And you want to use some type of string that kind of coordinates in case a little piece shows or anything like that. See how tight I can tie this because I gave myself some more slack there. After everything is tied up, you can adjust it to your liking. I decided to glue it down uh, so that it wouldn't be floating a little bit there. Here we go. Here's the cross that I painted. It goes right there in the center. And then I have all these little teeny bronze colored cross charms and I just added all of those on there. And here's the final project. So I hope that you like this burlap cross picture frame. Please hit the like button and feel free to share. Thank you. Bye.